Hello my friends, this is Regular Slasher and thank you for watching my videos. Yeah. I'm still in Oscar Castle but this time behind me is the actual dojo where I train in Kendo and Iaido in almost every day. Look at that. Look at that. It is so big that up to at least 200 people can train at the same time but yeah it's a big dojo and in fact I can even store my bogo or my kendo equipment inside so that um, after I get to work I just come here directly and train my mind body and spirit yeah you know what, it's a Sunday today and I feel like sharing to you one of my philosophies and wisdom that my sensei taught me with regards to Iaido or Kenjutsu practice but unfortunately before this becomes a lip service, okay, allow me to tell you what it really intends to say. In Japanese, it's called Saya no Uchi de Katsu. It means you win while the sword is still inside your your chi. Okay. Um, this is totally different from what social media is trying to sell you because let's see. All right. These are just some sort of uh, tour vehicle coming out. Oh, yeah, set. Yeah. A while ago, I mentioned that what social media is trying to sell, what swordsmanship is, that unfortunately is far from the truth already, in which people post pictures and videos of their own of their selfies of themselves of themselves and their martial arts movements which to me it's superficial you know because this is what you're trying to sell for example when swordsmen trying to cut the tatami mats I mean to me this is not interesting you know because you're just trying to cheapen the art but after you cut the tatami mat I'm like is that what you can do is this Kenjutsu is all about but to me I think Kenjutsu or Kendo or Iaido is just more than just the plain movements you know it's a world that contains the philosophies and mindset and the lifestyle on how to become a better person like you train yesterday today and for the days to come and to me it's an opportunity to measure your personal progress okay martial arts isn't just about showing what you can do or the movements that you can do to other people you know because as I said it's just superficial right yeah. about the philosophy that's called Saya no Uchide Katsu it's like you win without having to fight right this is counterintuitive, but let me tell you, it works in the real world. Okay? When somebody tries to attack you, but when you make it clear that you don't want to attack or back, the fight won't even begin. Because you're not interested, you're not entertaining the thought of hurting or putting scars on other people because 
you will find it counterproductive all right instead you just talk your way out of it as much as possible and it's a very small effort but it's a worthwhile effort to make the world a better place yeah it sounds so corny and cliche but in this day and age the world needs more of it all right don't you think yeah on the other side of the coin though where you see people who happen to practice martial arts where they try to instigate fights just because they just want to prove how tough they are and they thump their chests so like oh come on I can do this bitch I can kick your ass I've done three months of boxing yeah I can kick your swordsman ass and all that but to me it's very weak you know even if you're an accomplished martial artist but your mindset remains like that like you're you're so loud in social media just like a beta bitch um, I think that's the weakest form of yourself that when you find yourself doing that I think it's the best time to stop and if you happen to be on the receiving end where people try to provoke you into into hurting others it's like I think it's best to remember this philosophical phrase the sayano uchirekatsu which means winning well while the sword is still inside your sheath alright it means that you don't have to fight just to prove yourself but you need I think it's a, the best time it's the best thing in fights is that we, when you can avoid them as much as possible because it's just plain ridiculous you don't need it all right so that's it my friends and if you like what you just saw don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel so that it tells YouTube especially when you click the notification bell and it tells YouTube that you're digging my content and it motivates me to offer some of me to you in the future yeah and this is regular slasher thank you much love and domo arigato gozaimashita yeah and cut